The New World Order are marching us towards Armageddon, warns a U.S. Senator. The New World Order marching humanity towards Armageddon. Retired Virginia State Senator and retired Marine Colonel Richard Black has warned. Ukraine's application to become a member of NATO and Russia's mobilization of hundreds of thousands of troops represent a significant escalation, Colonel Black warns. He wrote uh, in an open letter to Congress on Tuesday, the globalists are marching us relentlessly towards this nuclear Armageddon. Zero Hedge reports Black pointed out, there would have been no war had we not overthrown the democratically elected government of Ukraine by violently ousting President Yanukovych in 2014. We promoted war by flooding Ukraine with massive arms shipments afterwards. The former senator said the U.S. could have achieved peace by simply pressing Ukraine to implement the 2014 Minsk, Minsk peace agreements, which it had signed, establishing a clear framework for settling outstanding issues peacefully. Ukraine promised to implement the Minsk agreements but chose instead to make war on the Donbass for the next seven years. And he said NATO could have sought peace, but chose war instead. He said NATO had ample opportunity for peace, but deliberately chose war. The U.S. realized that with Russia's back to the wall, it would have no choice but to attack. In 2007, U.S. Ambassador to Russia William Burns pointed, pointedly warned that movement towards absorbing Ukraine into NATO might well trigger war between Ukraine and Russia. Nonetheless, the Obama administration overthrew the Ukrainian president and flooded in weapons knowing that thing doing so would trigger a war. Black said billionaire elites who have to uh, have an interest in the region are making war profits, even if it means gambling the lives of hundreds of people um, and hundreds of millions of people across the globe. He's talking about a nuclear event, of course. He said, should we annihilate the world's population to intervene in a border war where the U.S. has no vital national interest? This is what the former senator asks. Black called for an immediate end to this war by making Ukraine a neutral, non-aligned state, just as we did during the Cold War with Austria in 1955, he explains. But it appears that former senator's plea to avoid further conflict went unheard after Volodymyr Zelensky's declared intent to apply for expedited NATO membership, as President Putin declared the annexation of 15% of Ukraine. I, I read somewhere else it was 20% of Ukraine, but anyway. Based on Article 5, any acceptance of Ukraine into NATO would automatically trigger a Russia-West World War, that is World War III. In a speech Friday, Putin said the U.S. created a precedent, quote-unquote, by using nuclear weapons against Japan during World War II. Last week, Navy Admiral Charles A. Richard, currently serving as the U.S. Strategic Command Chief, warned that possible direct armed conflict with a nuclear-capable peer could be ahead in the history of events, that is, could be coming to us in the future. This is terrible. Sean Adelton-Tabai on News Punch uh, reports this. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. Kindly support my Patreon account. The Daily Posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.